Well, you've likely heard this man's voice on the radio. Yeah, or no, you've heard his name somewhere before. Or you've needed to run into one of his family stores when the sink starts leaking, the toilet breaks. With 19 stores and growing, Mike Fratelloni is this week's Minnesotan to meet. The first Fratelloni's Ace Hardware and Garden Store opened back in 1975. It's a Fluid Master 242. Mike started working at the Arden Hills store when he was just four. Do you know what the inside of your toilet looks like? And he's been answering questions here system. about hardware ever since. I've lived within 10 miles of here my entire life. I'm really branching out. I've been going to the same Rosedale Mall my entire life and same movie theaters my entire life. It was Mike's father, Larry, who started the first store. You can still see him pop in from time to time. They're looking for the best looking man contest. Yeah. <laughs> just walked in. Yeah. Mike not only got his sense of humor from dad. What does dad think of everything now? He loves it. He loves it. He's got the best job in the world. He comes and goes as he wants and he gets all the money. So who could want anything better than that? <laughs> but he also inherited his dad's commitment to customer service. We can teach you hardware, but we can't teach you to be a nice guy. So, or gal. The company's 600 employees at 19 stores across the metro seem to get it. Fratelloni's has been voted best hardware store by J.D. Power & Associates for the past eight years. So we always say, and this sounds kind of goofy, you can wear a wedding dress to Fratelloni's because we'll do all your lifting, we'll load all your dirt. While Mike's brother Tom acquires new stores and crunches numbers, Mike has become the face of the company, advertising in numerous radio ads. Hello again, this is Mike Fratelloni from Fratelloni's Ace Hardware and Garden Stores. If you need to buy a toilet, right, go to a big box store. you got to buy a toilet once in your life. If you need to fix a toilet, come to a hardware store because we can show you how to do it. Mike teaches in-store and online, giving tips on everything from lawn maintenance. Scots, and that's always your insect control step. To fixing a sink on YouTube. I think the more they know the Fratelloni's, Larry, Tom, and, and myself, uh, the more likely they are to stay n with us instead of driving past us to go someplace else. And some customers have stuck around for quite a while. My father sold appliances for Sears before, and we'll have people come in and ask him a questions about appliances they sold him pre-1975. A commitment to the customer from the beginning. Where you have your connections, you're going to put that in a box. That Mike hopes carries the company into the future. Except that Mike has two daughters. He's very worried that they want no part of the business because <laughs> when he asked them, hey, do you guys want to come work with Dad at the sure. hardware store? They both said, actually, we want to be doctors. Oh. <laughs> so, How do you argue that? Right. right. <laughs> and it's probably because Mike's committed to the Children's Miracle Network. He's actually getting a Corporate Person of the Year Award. Wow. wow. For his commitment to that uh, that charity, so I mean, why not be a doctor? Well, if right? he could help me fix my toilet, that would deserve an award. <laughs> well, the funny thing is, is he said that a lot of people make their biggest mistake is they come in and they have no idea what parts they exactly. need, what toilet they have. So he said, if you have something break in your home, snap a picture on your cell phone and bring mm. it in, and then they can usually figure out what's mm. going on. I love my local hardware store. I mean, you go to the big box store, just like he said, it's very smart. You go there for the big. You need the toilet, you're going to buy once, but I find, like, I'm happy to pay a little more mm -hmm. to the local hardware store. If I don't have to walk through the giant store, you can walk in one of these hardware stores and just say, I need to fix this, and they're like, ah, right here. Yeah. Well, and I did ask him, I said, why do you post all this stuff on YouTube? You're giving free advice to yeah. thousands of people, and he said, I know I am, but like he said in the piece, I know that hopefully if I'm teaching them how to fix this stuff, yeah. that they'll pick us over somebody else. It's cool. It's good. Yeah. Hmm. Very good. Next time you fix a toilet, I want a video of that. <laughs> that not I'm bad with plumbing. Yeah. Really? Not bad with plumbing. Okay. How about some pumps? Some pumps, I have my issues. I think, <laughs> I think this deserves a sexiest anchor alive. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs>